I am back for some more Pokemon Y Wonderlock. And I have everything I need. They're connected to the internet. Um, I have the rare candies. So let's get started! By catching... Well, actually, I don't think I have Pokeballs. Whoops! <laughs> Huh, yeah, kind of, kind of forgot, because I believe you could buy them, but, uh, yeah, I kind of, kind of maybe forgot a little bit, so I think we're just gonna go ahead and run away. That technically doesn't count, since I don't have Pokeballs yet, but, whatever. I physically couldn't catch it because I didn't have Pokeballs. It may be slightly my fault, but I'm not going to give up at the second encounter just because I forgot to get whatever. I don't care. Don't need to learn how to catch things. But today, we're going to start with the Wonder Trades. Now, something that I forgot to mention, which is a rule in Egg Locks because of the rare candy thing. When I get a rare candy, because I know there are like several of those in this game. Like, when I get one, I need to immediately use it on something. I can't wait and be like, hey, I haven't used one from before, unless I keep track on how many rare candies I've gotten, but I don't see the point in doing that. So, yeah. The ridiculous amount of Pokeballs that you have there. Anyways. But yeah, so I need, if I get a rare candy, I need to use it immediately, so that's another rule I remembered when thinking about that stuff, so, yeah. Another rule that needs to be added. Eh. Okay, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. Shut up. <laughs> oh my goodness. He is so stupid. <laughs> like, Shauna is really stupid. Alright, now we can catch a Pokemon and want to trade it. So let's have some fun. Alright, so, and technically, and a lot of people do like to skip that first thing because it's always a Pidgey and it's always the same level, it's literally always the same. So people do like to skip it and say that this is their real first encounter, even on like regular Nuzlocke's. Where it actually matters the things you get. So I do kind of want to use Pound, but I don't know how well it's going to work. Okay, it did, it did a bit of damage, okay. We'll see how much this does. And then we can catch this thing, probably, hopefully. Oh. Alright. Alright, stop it. Let me, just, let me just catch a Pokemon over here. Pokeball! And... Did it. Okay. So now, we need to gain some XP. Okay, so let us now do some wonder trading. Yay, we got a Fletchling. So, give a nickname. Oh yeah, and we also have like, we also have like, um, like, oh no, I forgot about it. The dupes clause, we, we have that still, because we don't want to get a bunch of duplicates. Unless I actually want to keep it, but, you know, still, I don't think we'll get a duplicate that I want to keep. Okay, um, dang, why do I, like, I, I keep forgetting my names. We'll just, we'll just name something really stupid. Yay. <laughs> and I am, like, absolutely sure that I spelled Genji wrong. Okay, let's go to Wonder Trade. I get it. Stop. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's wonder trade. Okay, so we start with our starter. Right there. He's level 6, so when we get a Pokemon that is that is under level 6, we will level it up to 6. And then, uh... And I'll tell you that while doing this, I may have done some of them out of order. So, yeah. We'll have to make sure that we get everything and pay attention to it. Okay, so what are we going to get for our misspelled Genji? 
It's a magic card. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to lie. That's going to be pretty good when it evolves, but it's going to suck for now. So, oh boy. Well, actually, okay, we haven't... Oh, jeez, it's... Okay, whatever. Well, it, it, as long as it's not, like... What is it? As long as it's not over, like, 21, I think we'll be fine. What is it? What level is it? It is level 10, which is pretty good. So that means we are closer to an actual move, but I think... No, it only has Splash. Okay, good. And now we're getting rid of this guy, so... Uh, depending on what we get, hopefully this will actually be good, so I can maybe use something. Because this may not be very good if, like, the best Pokemon I get is, uh, Magikarp. Ugh. <laughs> this is, like, really disappointing. Um, the good thing is I don't really have to level Magikarp right now, because it's at a level 10. I mean, I would like to get it to 15, so that it can, you know, get a move that it can, you know, use to damage things, but I'm not going to worry about that too much right now, because, yeah. Wow, it's taken a while. I mean, obviously not a lot of people are trading in, ooh, ooh, water types plus. Well, you're not getting any water types, because that's not a water type. If, see, if I had switched the trades, it would probably be really good, I assume. Because they would have liked my, oh, come on! <laughs> it's terrible! has a move that it can use, and it'll be at least level 2. Technically, it'll probably be higher, but mainly the leveling is for, like, later stuff, so that, you know, I don't, like, have any problems. So, now that we've done that, what's in here? A level 2 Caterpie, exactly. So, how, how good is it? So, it is a neutral nature. It does have tackle, which is nice. On uh, this thing is up defense minus special attack. What kind of a... <laughs> Whatever. Obviously these aren't... Unreasonably... And, and obviously these aren't bred. Whatever. Let's, let's move on. Okay, so we need to technically move the Caterpie up front because, you know, I literally... Oh God, this is going to be a problem. At least we can catch a Pokemon in the Santa Loon Forest. I need to make sure there isn't any random items, but I don't think there are. Okay, let's try to, like, make this a little bit better. Oh, come on, not a fight! No! God, this is terrible. Uh, <laughs> This was a mistake. Uh no, we're gonna have so many problems here. Oh, I guess this is a Zigzagoon. Oh, no, okay. So I don't know how good we're going to do against the Zigzagoon. Oh no, uh... <laughs> uh... <laughs> no! If I had reversed the Wonder Trades, it would be all good now. Possibly, but not really. God dang it, I think I'm going to lose, because I... I, I mm. Okay, so he's lowering my defense. Uh, I may lose this Wonderlock already. <laughs> but I don't want to lose. Uh, crap. Because I don't have any potions. I don't have anything besides this Caterpie that can hurt anything. Uh... <laughs> Why? Just why? Uh... Ah! <laughs> God dang it! <sighs> okay, well, <sighs> okay. I think what we're going to do here is just say that I have officially lost, because I literally cannot hit the Zigzagoon, and it's just going to whittle me down until I'm at absolutely zero. So, since I have lost this close to the beginning, and can start over, even though it's going to take a little bit to start over, but I'm going to try to go a little bit quickly through it, 
I may actually, like, continue to have the video, like, pause and stuff. Or maybe just, you know, continue on to the next video. Whatever. Um, yeah. So I'm going to restart it and get it up to where I do my first Wonder Trades. Just so that I can, you know, make it so that we are continuing with this. Because I don't really have a reason to stop right now. Because, like I said, it's really early. We haven't even gotten into the forest. And I've already lost. The luck. <laughs> Uh, I was like, I thought it was like so good, but that it's like terrible. Uh, whatever. Let's try this again. I'll be right back. Uh, no, which means I need to like, uh, whatever. Uh, next time we will be at about this point, except for before the wonder trades, and I will have everything back to where it was.